Assalamu alaikum fam. Hope you're doing fantastic. We continue our reading of the Sahih International Translation of the Quran. I have already finished it. I finished it during Ramadan 2021. But we're going to read it here on the channel as well. I have I have read the Quran twice fully and I'm on my third Quran reading which is the clear Quran. And when I finish that one I'll let you know. So we're in Surah Al-Baqarah picking up on 283. Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim And if you are on a journey and cannot find a scribe then a security deposit should be taken and if one of you entrusts another then let him who is entrusted discharge his trust faithfully and let him fear Allah his Lord and do not conceal testimony for whoever conceals it his heart is indeed sinful and Allah is knowing of what you do to Allah belongs whatever is in the heavens and whatever is in the earth. Whether you show what is within yourselves or conceal it, Allah will bring you to account for it. Then He will forgive whom He wills and punish whom He wills. And Allah is over all things, competent. The Messenger has believed in what has revealed to him from his Lord, and so have the believers. All of them have believed in Allah and His angels and His books and His messengers, saying, We make no distinction between any of His messengers. And they say, We hear and we obey. We seek your forgiveness, our Lord, and to you is the final destination. Allah does not charge a soul except with that within its capacity. It will have the consequence of what good it has gained and it will bear the consequence of what evil it has earned. Our Lord, do not impose blame upon us if we have forgotten or erred. Our Lord, and lay not upon us a burden like that which you laid upon those before us. Our Lord, and burn on us not with that which we have no ability to bear. And pardon us, and forgive us, and have mercy upon us. You are our protector, so give us victory over the disbelieving people. Surah Ali Imran, Bismillah Rahman Rahim. Alif, Lam, Mim Allah, there is no deity except Him, the ever-living, the sustainer of existence. He has sent down upon you, O Muhammad, the book in truth, confirming what was before it, and He revealed the Torah and the Gospel, before as guidance for the people, and He revealed the criterion, i.e. the Quran. Indeed, those who disbelieve in the verses of Allah will have a severe punishment, and Allah is exalted in might, the owner of retribution. Indeed, from Allah nothing is hidden in the earth nor in the heaven. It is He who forms you in the wombs, however He wills. There is no deity except Him, the exalted in might, the wise. It is He who has sent down to you, O Muhammad, the book, in it are verses that are precise. They are the foundation of the book and others unspecific. As for those in whose hearts is deviation from truth, they will follow that of it which is unspecific, seeking discord and seeking an interpretation suitable to them. And no one knows its true interpretation except Allah. But those firm in it in knowledge say, We believe in it. All of it is from our Lord and no one will be reminded except those of understanding who say our lord let not our hearts deviate other deviate after you have guided us and grant us from yourself mercy indeed you are the bestower our lord surely you will gather the people for a day about which there is no doubt indeed allah does not fail in his promise Indeed, those who disbelieve, never will their wealth or their children avail them against Allah at all, and it is they who are fuel for the fire. Theirs is like the custom of the people of Pharaoh and those before them. They denied our signs, so Allah sees them for their sins, and Allah is severe in penalty. Say to those who disbelieve, you will be overcome and gathered together in hell, and wretched is their resting place. Already there has been for you a sign in the two armies which met in combat at Badr, one fighting in the cause of Allah and another of disbelievers. They saw them to be night, to be twice their own number by their eyesight. But Allah supports with his victory whom he wills. 
Indeed, and that is a lesson for those of vision. Beautified for people is the love of that which they desire, of women and sons, heaped up sums of gold and silver, fine branded horses and cattle and tilled land, that is the enjoyment of worldly life. But Allah has with him the best return, i.e. paradise. Say, shall I inform you of something better than that? For those who fear Allah will be gardens in the presence of their Lord beneath which rivers flow, wherein they abide eternally. And purified spouses and approved from Allah, oh, and purified spouses and approval from Allah, and Allah is seeing, i.e., aware of His servants. Those who say, Our Lord, indeed we have believed, so forgive us our sins and protect us from the punishment of the fire. The patient, the true, the obedient, those who spend in the way of Allah, and those who seek forgiveness before dawn. Allah witnesses that there is no deity except Him, and so do the angels and those of knowledge that He is maintaining creation and justice. There is no deity except Him, the exalted in might, the wise. Indeed, the religion in the sight of Allah is Islam, and those who were given the scripture did not differ except after knowledge had come to them out of jealous animosity between themselves. And whoever disbelieves in the verses of Allah, then indeed Allah is swift in taking account. So if they argue with you, say, I have submitted myself to Allah in Islam, and so have those who follow me. And say to those who were given the scripture, and to the unlearned, Have you submitted yourselves? And if they submit in Islam, they are rightly guided. But if they turn away, then upon you is only the duty of notification. And Allah is seeing of his servants. Those who disbelieve in the signs of Allah and kill the prophets without right and kill those who order justice from among the people give them tidings of a painful punishment. They are the ones whose deeds have become worthless in this world and the hereafter and for them there will be no helpers. Do you not consider, O Muhammad, those who were given a portion of the scripture? They are invited to the scripture of Allah that it should abrate between them. Then a party of them turns away and they are refusing that is because they say never will the fire touch us except for a few numbered days and because they were deluded in their religion by what they were inventing so how will it be when we assemble them for a day about which there is no doubt and each soul will be compensated in full for what it earned and they will not be wronged Say, O Allah, owner of sovereignty, you give a sovereignty to whom you will, and you take sovereignty away from whom you will. You honor whom you will, and you humble whom you will, and your hand is all good. Indeed, you are over all things competent. You cause the night to enter the day, and you cause the day to enter the night. And you bring the living out of the dead, and you bring the dead out of the living, and you give provision to whom you will without account, i.e. limit or measure. Let not believers take disbelievers as allies, i.e. supporters or protectors rather than believers. And whoever of you does that has nothing, i.e. association with Allah, except when taking precaution against them in prudence. And Allah warns you of himself and to Allah is the final destination. Say, whether you conceal what is in your breasts or reveal it, Allah knows it, and He knows that which is in the heavens and that which is on the earth. And Allah is over all things competent. The day every soul will find what it has done of good present before it and what it has done of evil, it will wish that between itself and that evil was a great distance. And Allah warns you of Himself, and Allah is kind to His servants. Say, O Muhammad, if you should love Allah, then follow me, so Allah will love you and forgive you your sins. And Allah is forgiving and merciful. Say, Obey Allah and the Messenger, but if they turn away, then indeed Allah does not like the disbelievers. Indeed, Allah chose Adam and Noah and the family of Abraham and the family of Imran over the worlds. Descendants, 
some of them from others, and Allah is hearing and knowing. Mention, O Muhammad, when the wife of Imran said, My Lord, indeed I have pledged to you what is in my womb. Consecrate for your service, so accept this from me. Indeed, you are the hearing, the knowing. But when she delivered her, she said, My Lord, I have delivered a female, and Allah was most knowing of what she delivered. And the male is not like the female, and I have named her Mary, and I seek refuge for her in you, and for her descendants from Satan, the expelled from the mercy of Allah. So her Lord accepted her with good acceptance, and caused her to grow in a good manner, and put her in the care of Zechariah. Every time Zechariah entered upon her in the prayer chamber, he found with her provision. He said, O oh Mary, from where is this coming to you? She said, It is from Allah. Indeed, Allah provides for whom he wills without account. At that Zechariah called upon his Lord, saying, My Lord, grant me from yourself a good offspring. Indeed, you are the hearer of supplication. So the angels called him, while he was standing in prayer in the chamber. Indeed, Allah gives you good tidings of John, confirming a word from Allah and who will be honorable, abstaining from women and a prophet from among the righteous. He said, My Lord, how will I have a boy when I have reached old age and my wife is barren? He, the angel, said, Such is Allah, and he does what he wills. He said, my Lord, make for me a sign, he said. Your sign is that you will not be able to speak to people for three days, except by gesture, and remember your Lord much, and exalt him with praise in the evening and the morning. And mention when the angel said, O Mary, indeed Allah has chosen you, and purified you, and chosen you above the women of the world. O Mary, be devoutly obedient to your Lord, and prostrate, and bow with those who bow in prayer. That is from the news of the unseen, which we reveal to you, O Muhammad. And you were not with them when they cast their pens, as to which of them should be responsible for marrying. Nor were you with them when they disputed. And mention when the angel said, O Mary, indeed Allah gives you good tidings of a word from him whose name will be the Messiah, Jesus, the son of Mary, distinguished in this world and the hereafter and among those who brought near to Allah. He will speak to the people in the cradle and in maturity and will be of the righteous.